my god. <laughs> we lost. So fucking what? He sand <laughs> No way, man. Who I don't know. I'm sorry. Like, why the fuck didn't I check that? Like, that's what I'm wondering. Like, smoke and the bomb is still committed here Aligi's gonna finally peek out he gets himself one gets traded by Shroud and Skadoodle though and Fugly closing that one out onto Shroud Skadoodle left alone one on three again picked up the first one he's got the off this time this would be another highlight reel for him if he could get it both players not looking to heaven they're gonna be coming out towards that uh, lower CT bomb plant committed Nitro jumps over actually I believe he saw him we'll throw in an aid Incendiary comes in too, full blind Skadoodle, can't do much in this position. Get a Molly. he's gotta get these flicks, he's gotta be so quick. He's gonna back off towards Lung Tunnel. Smoke comes into the site, he's spotted the head, he's spotted the cap of Nitro, he's gonna get mollied. Forced to change up his position here, in the smoke, he tried to go for the no scope onto a Dren, he gets it! Oh my, what a hold, what a flick! Gets Nitro as well. It can't get much, Skadoodle holding truck once again, they're smoked off, jumping on top of Liege. Goes big onto nothing, but Skadoodle flicking onto one. Gonna stop the bomb carry with a double. Can he get the triple? He's looking for this peak. Gets the flick out of Nitro. Can he get the quad? He flicks down! Are you kidding me? Skadoodle! He's so nuts. He's absolutely... He needs Skadoodle to come in and help him out here. Shocks, he's gonna get caught, but Freak not hitting the shot. Skadoodle there to help out instead, and he gets a double kill. And he's still alive inside. They don't have a kit, and that bomb's actually been ticking. Skadoodle getting one more shot. He's gonna get it! Smith goes down, and Skadoodle with that quad kill. One versus... Can he make the one versus five actually happen? I, don't, I really don't think so. There it is. Oh, he hits the wall bangs. He got the actual wall bang there from Yard. That is glorious. Skadonglas has gone Super Saiyan. Oh yeah. yeah. He's gonna get the first kill. That's Big Soy down. There's a second one from Scream. The Angels are working out magnificently there. Three in a row. Cloud9 will finally get themselves into the bomb site, but they're in a two on three now. Team Screamy putting in work. There's gonna be a long rotation from the uh, last play there for Kugan, that's Rain coming in. And the CTs will wait patiently for this retake to begin. Again, they don't have a kit, as we mentioned at the beginning of the round. So time is of the essence. Nothing going for the spray down, not going to find it. And he's going to try and hold things down outside the bomb site as the remaining two players come in. Uh, Fox is being tagged down to two HP. Skadoodle will finish him off. And that's down to Skadoodle's of clutch now as he finishes the second oh, last player, amazing. finds the third. Dennis leaving the building as well. Just a great clutch hold there. But uh, it's all quiet in team main as the push begins. Skadoodle gets the first frag onto Flame. He's going to be flashed off. Lots of counter flashes coming in from the CTs. Edward of great crossfire there. Going to take up Sean Gedz as he comes out of the drop zone. Looking for another frag, but Skadoodle is still on point. There's a third frag for Skadoodle. Looking for a fourth. Two CTs remain for him to find. And they're finding frags elsewhere. Two versus two. Shroud needs to come good for his teammates, but he's not going to do it. So he's finding the frag. Bomb being smoked off. Down to Skadoodle to clutch. He needs to ace this round. Repositioning now, taking down C's. Just Zeus remaining with 8 HP. He's going to be going for the Glock. He must know he's tagged. And he's going to finally ace for his team and uh, trade rounds once again here for Cloud9. They have the lead, and right now they're setting up for a bit of a mid engagement, just taking control of mid and short. And they're actually going to run in here and check everything out. They're going to go really aggressive here, which is a little bit unusual for Titan, but I like this play coming out. Skadoodle's going to take down MBK. Swag charges out, Ooh. doesn't get the first kill, actually has to reconnect with that one. Now it's going to be down to a two on three. Skadoodle coming through. Great shot. He's really on fire, and that's going to be the quad kill for... ...away from death, and suddenly it's all on the aforementioned AWP for Cloud9. Skadoodle, a flick of the wrist. You have to live up to that orp's name here if he wants to get anything done. And you have to feel it's only a matter of time before he gets killed by a G2 Kingwin member, most likely shocks. It's got a look coming with the oh at Hello. least that one. That means a plant as well. Yeah, that secures the bomb plant, so that's economy moving forward and shroud. Sorry, Google, I should say. Now in a position where he can say, come up, bros. Now I don't have to worry about aggressing, I just have to worry about defending. But sometimes the best form of defense is a strong offense. That's exactly what Skadoodle's done. Lands the next frag, and the next one as well. This could be a 1 4 v 4 clutch. Oh, he's pulled it off! What the hell's happening? I was looking at a corpse.
Thank you very much. We do have the pistol off between these two teams. And Luminosity are making their way through the toilets. The toilets are unsanitary, James. Skadoodle's there. There it is. First kill, spots the bomb. Makes the call to his teammates, and he wraps around the back. What are they expecting? What's going on, James? Why do they not see Skadoodle? I don't know, but Skadoodle completely wrecked them on the They're going to be moving around. forward. They are going to be able to drop some Vamuses and have a, have a little bit of a force buy here in this round. And one of the things that I kind of hate to say, but in that situation where Devil Walk was, if he would have had an M4A4, he might have actually been able to take down Sean Garris as well because of that slower rate of fire on that M4A1S. Oh, oh my geez. God, Skadoodle, you got to be kidding me. He's going for seconds. Finds a little bit of damage there on a Devil Walk as well, but he gets the wall bang. It's going to be AZ that takes him down, and the bomb has been planted, so now it's the retake on point from Dignitas. Skadoodle charges out, bags himself two frags, and a third as well. Huge individual. Performance it from seems him. going straight to bathrooms. They actually dink Sean Garris. So I'll push him up with this one on the stairwell on the flank. That's Skadoodle. He pulls up the 5 7. He gets himself a double. He's got the AWP. Picks up a tech 9 though. Look at that. The triple. The quad. Oh, He's gonna get the ace. No. <laughs> it's just. It's just too much. It's never ending with this guy. It's, it's just unreal. Perfect here from Cloud9. Time is just running out for VP. They need to work out what they're going to do and the, what they're doing now. You can see there's actually a flank coming over Stacks. He gets taken down and all of a sudden, running off the scoreboard. Skadoodle takes three kills. And now Taz is the last man remaining. And this is fantastic. It's not right now, and unfortunately, it doesn't look like it's happening. No. Stewie's was chomping at the bit to get towards Banana, but never made the move down there. Slemmy's kind of hesitating. Do I stick on B? No, you need to start making the play. Good flash comes out again, though. Skadoodle waiting so patiently to land these shots, but backs out of it. There goes nothing. Now suddenly it's down to Shroud and Skadoodle to try and hold on towards A. Slemmy and Stewie are on the way, but it's a little too late for this one. Skadoodle rails down. Dennis has a bit of a lineup here. Guess. Oh, Skadoodle! Sick damage comes out. Now it's down to a 1v2. but could be dangerous here. Now, how much damage can he get done? He'll get the peak, he'll spot an extra player. Now, he knows he's in trouble right now. He needs some uh, support, but there is nobody. He's got to get it done by himself. He gets a double. Excellent stuff there from Skadoodle. It's just one man left, of much course. Much like Cobble, called. two impact kills the shotgun, but Skadoodle is still alive. And as well, the plant's going to come in, and nothing's watching for the rotation, too. So, it's going to go on to the ground. Unfortunately, Skadoodle does have to watch out as two players are working their way in, but he's able to hold that off as well. Picking up one more. Didn't spot the second as of yet, and N1, nicely done. Peeks back out. Now, Skadoodle's stuck between a rock and a hard place. Essentially, he's going to peek out, but he's got to watch his flank. There's the first shot. Now, check behind you, and no, he escapes. He's in the safe flank position now, and he can just walk away. Is this going to be the ace from Skadoodle waiting for the last shot? And he's going to do it! Skadoodle with a huge clutch grabs the ace! And a fourth round up on the board for C9. Playing his way towards the B sector. Right Here we go. Pop flash comes in. Doesn't really catch anyone, but it's going to be Skadoodle being the one man turret. Takes one, takes two, looks for more, but now the score comes into play. And Skadoodle gets a triple. That's what we want to see. That's the power that that man can have to these rounds. It was his first pickup, but some damage does go back onto Cloud9. And in fact, a kill as well will be had. Nothing. Finding one in the zone, but Skadoodle, what? Finds a very great flick onto Kenny S to take him down. Didn't even look like he hit anything there. Just. Whips a kill up from nowhere, and all of a sudden, it's the same situation as we had in the last round. Oh, I guess they could have dropped in one connector. Deploying flash bang. Ah! Oh! Wow, that guy really didn't kill you. Hello. Actually, watch automatic. It's still here. An automatic is just over. He gets him in that smoke, but a good response from Skadoodle. Early rotation out of B gives up the sight, but it's now him one versus two. Finesse is trying to find the angle. Skadoodle goes back out for more. He's going to repeat this again. Gets the information, and Skadoodle pulled it off. That's crazy. DSM trying to stick together. Uh, Slemmy, I'm going to go for the plant. Oh, just bouncing around. Find one. She links it into the second as well. The headshot comes out on towards Tarek. His teammate will be picked off. Oh, that goes down actually onto the bomb off the back of him. Go for this close angle face. Finds it with a no scope actually on towards Peter as well. I've cut the peaks in. He could take him down instantly. Just swat him away with the orc close on the shoulder. Peter isn't really going to work out. Wants to get a little bit aggressive. Finds it in the end. And you will actually get the defuse as well. Oh my god, Skidrill is so good. Taking a gamble, jumps up to Molotov at the beginning. First gets the first one. JDM, and he will smart play there. Perfect play for him. You get that first pick of CT. Although it might be an amazing idea and great frag footage to go pushing forward, but getting one frag and pulling back, that is perfect CS. You get information, you take down one of their key players, and then you don't give anything back. Get back and play very passively. Make the T's work for it. That's exactly what he's done there. So all of a sudden now, CLG, they have to find a pick. JDM has got nothing to play. He's just going to have to come out and face Kadoodle. And nine times out of ten, he's going to win that battle. And now oh it's going to be goodness. easy picking for him. And yep. there it is. Fantastic stuff from Skadoodle. Locks wow. him down and takes him to the match point.
That is the skadoodle that we like to see right there. That's why people are saying that he's up in the in the argument there. Yo everybody, this is Nerdgasm here, so thank you for watching this video. But before it ends, I just want to give a quick shout out to one of my in real life friends. He's actually dropped his first music video, which is really sick. So click the video on the screen right now to get to it, and make sure to check it out. Subscribe to his channel, leave some nice comments, and yeah, peace out everybody. I hope you have a very nice day.